First, we start off by establishing the perimeter of our building with steel stakes and string line. Then we run a parallel line to our first perimeter line and a perpendicular line. This establishes the building footprint and then a diagonal line to make sure that the building is square. Now it's time to establish the building elevation, also known as shooting our heights. And we adjust our string lines to the building foundation height to see through the transit. After the perimeter of our building has been established, we're ready to lay out our helical piles. Colossal screws drilled into the ground till they hit the right soil PSI compaction. When this happens, the piles are ready to act as a foundation for our tiny homes. First, we locate the center of the helical pile going off of our construction drawings. We mark those centers with yellow paint and we're ready to start installing the helical piles. The helical piles are installed a minimum of seven feet into the earth. This torque indicator lets us know when we hit the proper amount of pounds per square inch, indicating the point at which we can set in the foundation. Then we bolt the top cap, acting as a foundation for the structure to be set upon. Please stay tuned for part two. Please subscribe. Thanks for dropping by.